CSI 2140 Analyze Mode Experts Bump Test Equipment Off My name is Johan van Pijnbroek and in this video tutorial I will show you how to collect with the CSI 2140 machinery health analyzer a traditional bump test. So we will measure the natural frequencies on an installation when the installation is not running. What you are seeing here now is a home screen of the CSI 2140 Machinery Health Analyzer. To go to a bump test, to start a bump test, go to F7 Advanced Analyze and the bump test is part of the expert modes. Here are six experts at the bottom, but there are more experts and the bump test is in a more expert. So first go to F7 More Experts and here F2 bump test equipment off. Now there are two settings here. First one is to start the collection. Second one is to modify the settings. First of all, we will try to work with the settings as they are coming in the analyzer. So I simply gonna start data collection. And now you see here at the bottom waiting for trigger. That means that the data collector is now already measuring, but is waiting for an impact. So I will now impact the installation. And he has captured his first impact, as you can see here. And there is a spectrum calculated. Now he will average this six times, so he's waiting for the second impact. Before I continue, I'm going to show you this part here. A part of the waveform that is stored is showed before the impacting level. That is called the pre-trigger percentage and that will be explained more in detail later on. So now I impact the machine a second time. Three times. Four. Five six and it's done to view the data press enter and now you see the impact here and you see the average spectrum you can store the data in the job mode by using store data f9 and if you want to know the natural frequencies of the system you can now install a cursor on it And you see that one natural frequency is 14 Hertz and another one is around 37 Hertz. This method will work very good in most applications. However, there are two exceptions. In two exceptions, maybe you have to customize the settings. And how can you customize the settings? Go to Setup menu F1. Here is the pre-trigger set to 10%. If you want to have it higher or lower, you can change it here. But what is very important is the trigger level here. The default value is 0.5 G's. That means that as soon as you start data collection, the data collector is in a kind of a wait mode. And as soon as it feels a vibration level higher than 0.5 G's, he will consider it as an impact and he will store the data. Now the two problems that may occur here are if there are already a lot of background vibration in the neighborhood or on the installation, maybe the background vibration is already higher than 0.5 G's and then the CSI 2140 machinery health analyzer will start collecting data without your impacts and then you don't have good data. If that is the case, you simply can make this number higher though, go to F9 set trigger, go to F10 and for example change it to 2 G's. And now only vibration levels higher than 2 G's will be considered as vibration coming from your impacts. You can also have the opposite scenario. Maybe you have a very, very rigid structure 
and your impacting force is very low. So you impact the machine heavily, but still the trigger level is not reached and data collection is not started. In that case, maybe you want to use a lower trigger level, so you go to the same menu, you go to set trigger level F10, and you change it till, for example, 0.2 Gs. So now 0.2 Gs will be considered already as your trigger level. But once again, in most applications, the template that is configured here will do a great job and there is no need to customize it. We are now at the end of this video tutorial. Please visit our website at www.assetweb.com-mhm for other video tutorials and product information. My name is Johan van Pijnbroek. Thank you for watching this video tutorial.